Anduin versus Valera. Well, hello, friends. Back with a little more of this, uh... Um... Cthune and Zoth Priest. I'm gonna keep these cards. And a Shadow Repain. Because why the heck not, right? Um... So yeah, this deck has been pretty fun so far. A few games in. And we're looking to curve out, which... Eh... There's, a, there's enough low mana minions here that you can just play on curve, which is really what you're looking to do. So, uh, okay, yeah, so now we're going to start loading up with the Death Rattles. We're taking Shifting Shade, because he's awesome. I might honestly Doomsayer next turn, just to stall out my opponent, depending what happens here. Yeah, he's looking at the one, too, like, who plays this card anymore? Well, he's looking at, like, who, who plays Priest anymore, but that's okay. I don't play enough... To really try and push super high. Even though I want to. Um, but that's okay. So I'm going to play. Uh, I'm going to make Priest work somehow. With this limited time. And uh, yeah I said this last video as well. But shout out to Enboss Dot. For. Uh, for this. For this deck list. What is that? Is he healing for three? I'll take a Farseer. I'll kill your Farseer for you. Yeah, and boss.com, I think, is his website. I hope he doesn't mind me giving... I'm giving credit to someone, so I think that's allowed, right? If not, I'll rip this video down. Whatever. But I don't know what my opponent's doing. Is he really debating healing one health and playing a 3-3? I hope he... I don't even care if he does or doesn't. I think I'm going to play Doomsayer no matter what. Well, if he doesn't, I think actually I'll play the 3-3. Or 3-4. Look, and this is... This is one of the ideas behind this deck that I like. Is, is he just AFK? How is he doing this? <laughs> How is this happening? I love this. This is... Oh! It went away. Yeah, okay, so I'm gonna play this just because I don't think he's gonna... Yeah, that was incredible. So I'm playing this because I'm expecting the 3-4 to get two turns of value. I don't think he's gonna... I mean, he could play a, a two drop and then eviscerate. Oh no, he can play the SI seven now. Yeah, that's actually pretty sweet. Oh well, is this worth a shadow word pain? I think so. I think going up against Rogue, that's worth a shadow word pain, right? Um, no, that would be an absolute wrong play. I will take Blood Mage Thalnos, because maybe I can combo with Excavated Evil? And if not, it's still a draw. Uh, Thank you. Yeah, I regret that decision now. Do I want to Shadow or Death this? What else is Rogue going to be playing that's big? It could be an Enzoth Rogue, which might stink for me. I yeah. I guess we'll just do it this way slowly. Hey, and Blood Mage Thalnos is going to be coming back, so that's another draw with my Enzoth. Yeah, so I'm loaded up on Enzoth. Now I really need to be working on the Cthune cards. So now it's time to stop, start top decking a little bit more Cthune. I got the best deals anyway. Oh, baby. Saparino. Okay, if he conceals, I'm really okay with that because I can clear it. Actually, I'm gonna have to clear it that way no matter what, because I can't let this. I can't let him get a fresh turn. Oh, three? Oh, yeah, this is my weakness, right? Well, that's one auctioneer gone, and I draw, right? And he, yeah, he gets a coin, I draw. There we go. Yeah, that's okay. I think that's okay. Yeah, so I need a. Uh, I might need a little bit of help for the next auctioneer. Hey, there's the Farseer he was hoping to play a long time ago now. Um, three or less? Look how sweet that card is. I will take you because you are more fun. Hey, lights out. And I'm going to do this. Even though against the Miracle Rogue, maybe this isn't even the best play at this point because it just gives him another turn to set up. But I'm kind of okay with that. Because I also need 
to be drawing other cards, mostly my Cthulhu's, because I don't think my Cthulhu is very buffed at all. There, I haven't played anything here, but that's okay. I don't even know how to how to rank the the progress of this game right now or characterize it in any sort of way, because. I'm not very familiar to, to be able to determine if this is like a miracle. Well, I guess it is miracle, but he could still throw an Enzoth in there. There's a few death rattles if he has the legendary. We'll see. Maybe he has a Malagos to one-shot me later on in a few turns. If he's just going to build his hand up. Just wants to do one to face. Maybe he just calculated I'm dead on in a couple turns. Um... I'm going to play the more power. Sure, this buffs the Cthulhu a little more. Eh, maybe I should have done it that way. Oh, well. We'll see. This is one more power. I know these things kill and this steals, but we'll see. Ooh, what about a Miracle Priest? No, that would stink. That would stink, actually. I'm willing to accept that. Another SI7? Other SI7? Clear my shade? I'm okay with that, I think. Oh, that's terrifying, actually. I regret saying I was okay with that. I might honestly entomb that. Because I don't think I... Oh, baby. Um... <laughs> um, I think I can Sylvanas and Doomsayer here. Is that a play? Or do I Crazed Worshipper and Doomsayer? Ooh, Auctioneer, you are terrifying me. Well, I know at least it's not in his hand right now, so that's something. So, I have that going for me. Uh, Crazed Worshipper and Doomsayer? Likely doesn't get any... Um, I mean, he could sap this, and then that's five, six, seven. So all he has to do is sap, and then the Doomsayer. Hmm. I, I think no I'll do it this way. Basically, Sap is really bad, and I don't think he's played... I don't remember him having played one already, so... I could be in trouble no matter which way I play. Since I don't really have any more of my removals? Oh no, maybe he is just setting up for a big miracle turn with Malagos. He only has one prep? So what is he going to do? Malagos, Sinister Strike, prep Sinister Strike? Am I... Wait, am I dead then? I guess that's one approach. Just say, yeah, just eat the... Yeah, I'll just... Uh... Alright, time to power up my Cthulhu a little. Ooh, wow, that's really bad. Really... Well, I mean, there's a bunch of Cthulhu cards in this deck, which I kind of like. I like the concept a lot, but... I guess there's not really that many. And there aren't really that many Cthulhu cards to begin with. I mean, there's enough to build a deck around the concept. But doing now oh oh he doesn't like that one i can respect that hey and there's a sap oh, okay oh he didn't have a sap then that was off the top that's uh he's really going for that um oh my this is this is very not excellent for me right now uh, i should have played that slower i think i might have honestly thrown down the twilight dark mender there just have some power on board because I, I think at this point I'm not unless I top deck a bunch of Cthulhu cards all in a row I'm not gonna get it and unless I get twin imps I think I'm in big big trouble well seven mana four six G's that's not excellent come on top decking skills this is the thing this is one of the things I feel like I need to be working on a little bit more is that nine there we go you're not gonna sap me now Trade into me and then double Twin M's. There we go. Look at this. Okay. Okay, so now we're going to top deck the 3 mana 2-1 to deal the damage. Then play Twin M's. And I don't know what we'll do after that, but it'll be pretty sweet, I think. Um, there we go. Top decking skills. Why did I... What did I tell you? There we go. Maybe my top decking skills are going to take me all the way to the top of the ladder. I'm just going to have a 24-hour marathon on, uh, no, I don't actually, I can't have time. I don't have time. Maybe next month. 24, I mean 12, 12, 12, not 24. Oh my goodness. I need to sleep. Yeah. 
Yeah, I think this is this is a much better position. Unless, of course, it is just going to be a massive Malagos turn, in which case, eh, can't do much about it. He's probably not good. I mean, he could auctioneer his way to a victory. But the double taunts is really nice. That's pretty sweet for him as well. Kill the wrong one, kill the wrong one. Yes. Wait, is that that is the wrong one, right? Yeah, that's the actual twin imp. Do I heal now? No, I'm gonna play Auctioneer as a threat. Cause that's gonna have to force removal on the auctioneer. That he might otherwise want to, you know, Malagos prep this face or something for what is that, nine then? It's just a four plus whatever. Not really that excellent for him. Oh boy. Yeah, we'll see who has the best deals now. Not a conceal, not a conceal. What the heck are you doing? He doesn't have any sort of charge activator. That's warrior, right? Is he just gonna conceal me? Come on now. Okay. Okay, I need to top deck two cards at a time. Oh boy. I can't even do anything. This is enemy minion. I feast upon the Alright, I mean this is well played, right? I mean he can Malagos me down now. He can do a cold um can he? No, both his preps are gone. He can't. I think I win here. Oh, what what preps did I see? Into a coin, into the coin. He got a coin earlier, right? Prep coin concede. That's what I'm hoping for. That's only 20. Still good. Just a little damage. I'm still good. He can. Uh, he used one evis, I think. Now I don't know what he used. What? Oh, he can still attack through it. He just wants to draw. Okay, I was really confused there. Hey, he can still attack. Oh, no. Oh. Is he just going to mill himself and just eat it? Please keep playing spells. <laughs> just mill yourself. I know you can. Just play sprint. Prep. Uh, prep. He's infinite prep. Like, I could have sworn I already saw two before this turn. Please play it. Just sprint and just mill yourself. Oh, he's going to do something awesome to kill me, though. I don't want to. The heck is this turn? Wait, did he not have enough? What other reason? But what resources do you have to win now? Is my question. Like I, I can't even. Do I bother playing this? Yeah, I think I play it for tempo now. It's whatever. I don't know what else he can have. He could have a Malagos. Yeah, this is well played. I don't know. I want to know what else is in your hand, though, Krumpus. If oh, it's, come on, at least show me that you have a Malagos, so I can know that I've been talking about it for not not for nothing. Hey, look at this. This deck is doing all right. All right, everyone. Ooh, Golden Holy Nova. Not using that right now. I'll see you later.